Hey, I'm CSM10495, and I'm going to be doing an unboxing of Windows 7. This is our home preview, premium edition. I had an ultimate edition. I traded with my cousin. He gave me 50 bucks. It was worth it for me. I won't use the ultimate stuff anyway. All right, let me get a close up. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to turn on my computer. It's running Vista. Well, it's um turning on. By the way, it's an HP TX2000 swivel screen touch screen, so we get all the works running Vista right now. And um we're going to Well, that's turning on. Let's do a brief unboxing here. Okay, so here's Windows 7. Let's open it up. I'm going to use a trusty pencil. Let's see. Just to break the seal. And there we go. There we go. Seal it's off. We're still waiting for Vista to turn on. And let's take this out. Ah, so look. It it just See this is completely no point in it. And Windows 7. Let's open this up. And there it is in all its beauty. Windows 7 upgrade. There's one CD. This is a 32 bit. Actually, these are probably DVDs, but you know. And this is the 64 bit. <laughs> uh, okay. So, and then here's some brief manuals upgrading from XP. Welcome to PC Simplified. And under there is the product key. I'm going to hide that so nobody steals it. Okay. Now, we'll be installing the 64 bit edition. And um, I'm on Vista right now. But I'm, I'm going to do the inevitable. This computer, let me tell you the story. I had to send it back to HP because um, it didn't work right. So, what I decided, what I'm doing is um, <clears throat> I'm completely reformatting the machine and getting a brand new slate with Windows 7. Okay? I mean, there's nothing on it. I had to send it back. They replaced the hard drive anyway. All right? So, let's get started. Here we go. I'm going to aim the camera at the computer, and we're going to see how we go. This is the installation of Windows 7 64-bit. Okay. Let me just get out of the random stuff that comes up. Because don't you hate when it comes with virus software and it's like, oh, your subscription's up. Oh, why don't you renew? Otherwise, we'll kill you. Well... That's just annoying me. Okay, so. guys, so we had some drop frames here. Um, we put the disk in the computer and it booted into it. And it's okay, about 10 minutes later after it's time. Okay. And now, according to the iPhone cam, the time is 7.11. And Windows needs to restart to continue. It had said um, a couple seconds ago, Windows is now installing updates. So, restarting 3. Two, one. Uh, you know the cool. And we're back to installing Windows. That's all the information we need right now. We once again the same thing. We finished copying Windows files, expanding Windows files, installing, installing. Now we're completing the installation. Collecting info, installing.
Windows and we're very close to being done, see? There you go. That's it, I'll turn it back on when something changes. Okay, on the screen, the uh, screen just flashed. Uh, you can, I think it actually fixed the resolution. Yeah, it looks a little bit nicer. Once again, down here, I'll give you a front information install Windows. And we still have the bar down here that isn't complete. And we shall continue to wait. I'll be back. Prime 720. Alright, you saw that message for like a half a second. Now we have starting windows. Wow, maybe we're done. Maybe. And say, please prepare your computer for first use. And that's all that's on the screen in case you want to. Anyway. Alright, we have the screen again. All right, it wants us to Windows 7 Home Premium, set up Windows, that's all that's on the screen, this window. Choose a username for your account and name for your computer to distinguish it on the network. I don't know what network they're talking about, but here, my username is DSM104945. Yes, and there you go. 10495 PC, it automatically entered that. Copyright Microsoft Corp. Okay. That looks good to me. And now let's go to next. We still have set up windows, so we only turn on the screen. And set a password for your account. Creating a password is smart security for calls that protects your, your user account from unwanted users. Be sure to remember your password and keep it in a safe place. Okay, well, let me do it by password. Hang on. Uh, I have it off the screen on purpose in case you're wondering. Okay, there we go. Password, I click next. You can find your Windows put I mean type your Windows product key still can set up Windows, there's nothing else there. And you can find your Windows product key on a label included with your package that came with your copy of Windows. This pr this label might also be on a computer case. Activation pairs your product key with your computer. Product key looks like this. Automatically activate Windows on the online. What is activation? I like to click these things so you guys can see what they look like. Here, I'll go down at that. You know, you guys can read that if you want. I don't need to read it to you. Okay, we're back. And privacy statement, nobody reads this. Okay, I'm going to turn the camera off while I enter this in. Okay, bye. Okay, see this lap? This is going to be, that one up there is how long it's going to take for Windows to turn on. This is the first restart of my Windows 7. 20 seconds in. Still no windows. <coughs> We've made progress. Forty one seconds in. No, no, this is sixty four bit windows here with three gigabytes of RAM. This should not take so long. 55 seconds. Still loading. I think this is getting a little ridiculous. A minute and three seconds already. Alright, we have a sound. Finally, a log on screen. Log on completed. Alright, so at 118, we're going to take about five seconds off for me typing. Alright, and it's fully ready to use. There. At 1 minute and 36 seconds. To tell you the truth, I think that took a little too long. But that was the first restart of my Windows 7 here. October 22nd came out today. Bye bye. <laughs>